Camila Cabello just opened up about that Shawn Mendes kiss that none of us will ever be able to unsee. What's up, it's Emil Ennis Jr. here with Clever News, and we all remember the hilarious and shocking video that Shawn Mendes shared of him and Camila kissing. You know, this one that now has almost 27 million views. And up until this point, while Shawn and Camila have been dating for a little while now, they avoided directly addressing their relationship. Though I know they haven't been shy when it comes to PDA while walking through the streets and swimming in various oceans at a coffee shop or pretty much anywhere they go. But now Camila is speaking about her relationship in that video for the first time. She talked to Ryan Seacrest on his radio show on 1027 Kiss FM about their public relationship. Yeah, honestly, it was just that we thought it was really funny because I mean I think it's just like it's a weird thing to be like two people falling in love like in the public eye and fans are standing this moment in the comment section one person wrote quote they did it right just a simple message for all to see I get it and I do it too just to prove my point point." and another said quote go Camila and Sean do your thing your life your rules and Twitter is still going off about that kiss video one person shared this video and wrote quote meet to people after saying they didn't enjoy Sean and Camila kiss and another said no one, absolutely not a soul. Camila and Sean, y'all been mocking how we kiss. So while everyone has had mixed reactions to their fish kiss, one thing is clear, we're happy that they're finally ready to share their relationship with their fans. It's about time, right? Ever since they nearly killed us at VMAs with that almost kiss, I've been ready for these two to officially go public. Yeah, me and basically every single person who was there and are watching at home almost lost our minds in that moment. Literally every celeb in the audience was screaming for them to just kiss. Joe Jonas even posted the video of him and his wife Sophie Turner and his brother Nick freaking out over this lack of kiss moment and captioned it, quote, hashtag VMAs are over, but we're still waiting for that kiss though. Well, you know what they say, be careful what you wish for because we definitely got that kiss. But Camila didn't only talk about that kiss on Ryan Seacrest's show. She also revealed that she's gonna be singing Senorita at the iHeart Festival this weekend in Vegas. So maybe Sean will join her on stage. We'll just have to wait and see. But at the iHeart Festival, she will also be performing her new songs for the very first time. Her latest single, Shameless and Liar, off her new album, Romance, just dropped a couple weeks ago, and we can't get enough of them. Camila spoke out about her new album and said, quote, these songs are basically the story of my life the past couple of years and the stories I've accumulated. I knew for a long time I wanted my album to be called Romance because these stories are about falling in love. Her song Shameless is about an unfulfilled crush while Liar is about falling deeper in love. So yeah, we definitely get the vibe of her album already. Her second solo album is expected to be released in its entirety by the end of this year and fans cannot wait. One person tweeted this series of adorable pics of Camila and wrote, quote, I love you so much. Your smile really brightens my day. I love you from the bottom of my heart and I'm so excited for romance. Take quiero, Camila. And another said, Shameless by Camila Cabello has to be some of her best work. I'm really ready for this romance album. Shameless is a certified bop. I hope this is the majority of the album's vibe. Seriously though, Camila, when are we getting this album? It's already mid-September and the clock is ticking on 2019. We're ready. But speaking of new music, we are still expecting a new album from Selena Gomez by the end of this year too. And both Demi Lovato and Rihanna have teased us with potential new albums. So ladies, let's get it together. I'm ready for some anthems, some bops, some ballads. I want it all. For now, I'll just be listening to Camila's two singles and Taylor Swift's new album on repeat, but I want to know what you guys think of the whole Sean and Camila relationship. Is there still any part of you that doubts these two? And what do you think of the kiss now that she's explained herself? Let me know down in the comment section below. After that, be sure to hit that subscribe button and click the bell so you never miss a single update. And then click right over here for another new story. Thanks for hanging out with me here at Clever News. I'm Emil Ennis Jr. and I'll see you soon.